हेलो फ्रेंड्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विश यू ऑल माय लिसनर्स ए वेरी वेरी हैप्पी दीपावली इन द सीरीज ऑन द इनकम टैक्स केसेस टुडे वी विल डिस्कस एन इशू व्हिच इज बेस्ड ऑन द डिडक्शन ऑफ टीडीएस ऑन द पेमेंट ऑफ हायरिंग ऑफ टैंक्स फॉर स्टोरिंग इडेबल ऑयल the question before bombay high court in the present case was that whether the liability of the assessee to deduct the tds in case of payment on the storage charges in various tanks comes under section 194 i or section 194 c this issue has been taken in the case of commissioner of income tax tds versus B Arun Kumar Trading Limited. This case has been reported in 465 ITR at page number 748, and the date of the judgment is 23rd February 2024. The facts of the case are like this: In the present case, the assessee was in the business of providing facilities and services for handling import oil of eatable oils. The assessee. has paid payment for storage charges in tanks and the assessee has deducted tds at the rate of 2% under section 194c because this is a payment in the nature of contract when the proceedings were going on the learned assessing officer was of the view that since the payment has been made for rent of the storage tankers so the tds should have been deducted under section 194 i section 194 i basically talks about the deduction of the tds in case of payment of rent which is for the use of land and building together with some furniture fittings which is appertaining to the land and building and the assessing officer held the assessee in default under section 201 sub section 1 and the assessee is liable to interest under section 201 sub section 1a for the short deduction of the tds this was the allegation of the learned assessing officer the cit appeal also appealed the order of the assessing officer so the matter came to the tribunal and the tribunal was of the considered view that in the present facts and circumstances by going through the rental agreement between the assessee and the tanks owners it is very apparent that the rent has been paid for the storage of the edible oil in the tanks along with some other ancillary services also and in any stretch of imagination this rent was not for the payment for the use of the land and building or any furniture and fittings appertaining thereto so in the present facts and circumstances the assessee has rightly deducted the tds under section 194c and the tds under section 194i does not apply to the assessee at all so whatever the additions or whatever the tax liability has been created by the assessing officer was deleted by the tribunal and when the matter came to the high court the high court also appealed the order of the tribunal that in the present facts and circumstances since the payment is made and is in the nature of the contractual payments so section 194 c is applicable and the assessee has rightly deducted the tds at the rate of 2% on the payment made to the various tank owners for their services not only for storing the edible oil but also for other ancillary services the high court also said that in the present case no land and building has been hired or there was no case of the assessing officer that the assessee has used the land and building along with furniture and fittings that is appertaining to the land or building so the provisions of section 194 i are not applicable in any case so whatever the liability has been created under section 201 sub section 1 and the liability in respect of interest under section 201 sub section 1a that was deleted by the high court at the end of this video once again i am repeating the name of the case the name of the case is 
कमिश्नर ऑफ इनकम टैक्स टीडीएस वर्सेज बी अरुण कुमार ट्रेडिंग लिमिटेड एंड दिस केस हैज बीन रिपोर्टेड इन फोर सिक्सटी फाइव एट पेज नंबर सेवन फोर्टी एट एंड द मैटर हैज बीन डिसाइडेड बाय ऑनरेबल बॉम्बे हाई कोर्ट एंड द डेट ऑफ द जजमेंट इज ट्वेंटी थर्ड फेब्रवरी टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी फोर थैंक यू फ्रेंड्स